How the heretics? Today I'm going to tell you a fascinating story about a fascinating person. And he's one of Jehovah Witnesses and his name is Rolf Johan, Johan Furuli. And he's probably the most famous Jehovah Witness in Norway. And he's a really nice guy. I spoke to him earlier today and I asked him if he wanted to be interviewed on my YouTube channel. And he respectfully declined because, well, because I'm an apostate and he's one of Jehovah Witnesses. But He's really nice. We had a nice talk and he said, told me several times that I should go back to the Jehovah Witness organization because according to him, it's God's one true organization. So he's a nice guy with a character and he has an excellent track record. He told me that he served as a um, circuit overseer from 1965 to 1972. Then from 1972 to 1974, he served as a district overseer. That means basically that he was Jehovah's right hand in Norway. And then from 1974 to 1975, he was arranging uh, classes for the elders, teach the elders how to be more, I don't know, elderly. <laughs> and then he said it was really exciting years, but then he had to step down due to health problems. So he stepped down in good standing and instead he served as a presiding overseer, that's, you know, the boss elder in a congregation, in Majorstua Oslo until I think it was 2010. And I actually lived in the neighbor congregation in Oslo. So I'm pretty sure we met more than once. And then after 2010 he moved to Larvik. So he has an excellent track record as one of Jehovah Witnesses and he is a true believer. What makes this special, first thing that makes this special, is that he actually have, he, he's actually a scholar. If you watch her in the Wikipedia entry, it says Rolf Furnelli, born 1942, is a professor emeritus in Semitic languages at the Oslo University of Oslo until his retirement in 2011. Furili started his studies of New Babylonian chronology in 1984. He became a Magister Artrum in 1995 and Doctor Artrum in 2005. Based on his studies, Furili has defended the religious views of Jehovah Witnesses, of which Furili is a member, including their view that Jerusalem was destroyed by the Babylonians in 607 rather than the broadly recognized dating of its destruction in 587 BC. So he's a scholar. Most uh, most Jehovah Witnesses, when they make kind of um, in the organization, they start as window cleaners and then they become circuit overseer. But this guy actually have a real education and uh, he's defending Watchtower. He wrote a lot of. It says here he translated a number of documents from Semitic languages and Sumerian into Norwegian and he's done a lot of work. Obviously not everyone agrees with what he done, but I think most people that know him would describe him as a very nice and sincere, true believing Jehovah Witness. His heart is in the right place. But the interesting in this um, Wikipedia here, it says in 2020, Furuli published a book entitled My Beloved Religion and the Governing Body, in which he maintains that the core doctrines of the domination are correct, but challenges the authority of the Jehovah Witnesses leadership. If you've ever been a Jehovah Witness, I can tell you that the main rule in Jehovah Witness religion is that you cannot criticize the leaders. You cannot criticize Jehovah, you cannot criticize Jesus, you cannot criticize the governing body. But he decided to do that. And that's a brave move. So I, I, I had to call him and I asked him, don't you think you will get this fellowship? And he said, I know I will be this fellowship. So it's fair to say that Rolf Furuli is a very brave Jehovah Witness. He's a true believer. He believes in the Watchtower mythology. He believes in Watchtower Jehovah, all of that. But he sees that the governing body goes beyond what is written. And therefore he decided to speak up against them. And that's a very brave thing to do. 
He knows that the governing body most likely will not listen to any form of criticism. Instead, they will punish him, they will crucify him, or at least they will disfellowship him. And he do, he's going to do this anyway. So that's why I want to promote his book called My Beloved Religion and the Governing Body. I haven't read it myself. It will be available from the 5th of June. But I, I feel some respect for a guy that is doing the right thing even though he has so much to lose. The Governing Body claimed that if someone criticizes us, it's because they are seeking glory for themselves. Well, in this case, this guy already have all the glory he need. He has an excellent track record. He's been a district uh, overseer. He's, he's a scholar. The governing body themselves are not scholars. And the Jehovah Witnesses in Norway like him. Many of them, you know, they memorized his name and his titles. So whenever someone says something about the New World Translation, well, then they say, have you heard about Rolf Thurli? He is blah, blah, blah at the university, expert in Hebrew, blah, blah, blah. He already have all the glory he need. And now he will lose all of that for daring criticizing the octopope, eight imperfect man in Brooklyn. <laughs> so now I think he's an upstanding Jehovah Witness wanting to do the right thing. So. If you believe in the Watchtower mythology, but you realize there's something wrong in this religion, you know, maybe you see in the Australian Royal Commission, stuff like that. Well, then I would recommend the book My Beloved Religion and the Governing Body, written by Rolf Thurli. I haven't read it myself. I'm a lazy apostate, and I really don't care about organized religion anymore. I believe in the shiny bucket and Bob Almighty, the shiny bucketeer. So, but I hope you like this video. I hope you subscribe to my channel. Maybe you noticed I, uh, my camera is in the garage. They have to fix something. So that's why I did this way. So, But the book is called My Beloved Religion and the Governing Body, written by Rolf Johan Furri. So. The best thing is to, and most honest, is to give them food. Wait, 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 no! <laughs> oh. <laughs> no! Oh my god. Oh, honey, good. Go away, go away, go away. Apostates! Apostates! Help! Oh my god. Oh. Uh, my goodness. <laughs> Ah!